Godson of Ban Ban 3 has a huge problem and it's a lot worse than you think. We all know when it came to Godson of Ban Ban or Godson of Ban Ban 3, Two, the biggest problem they had was refunding. Well, you know, also beside the whole entire game was bad and was getting lots of bad reviews, but you know, it was refunding. Lots of people were refunding. Even people that bought it to live stream and do videos on it were refunding it after because, you know, they didn't like it. It was a bad game. And the creator went out there saying, yeah, harassing and attacking the game developers and saying how it's a bad game is one thing. But after refunding and doing videos and live streams, they're making so much money off of it. They're saying that's a scammery, scummy material, some scummy acting. I mean, is you know, behavior. That's what I meant to say. But anywho, so to actually fix that in Content of Band Band 2, they try to fixed it fix it but you know they they did they did it in a bad way so if you played garden of band band 3 or seen anyone else play it i definitely did play and i'm kind of regretting it right now because i cannot get a refund <laughs> i was you know in the beginning if the game was good i wouldn't have refunded it but at the end of the day after playing the game it's not really good the same problem stands without the entire game it doesn't seem like that much care and passion is coming out and it's kind of just being pumped out by algorithm it kind of feels like half the actors are the same the acting doesn't have the most oomph doesn't have the most you know strength in them you know they don't really want to Hire, I think, like professionals. They just, you know, do it themselves with like one other actor and I think friends and just devs. But if you played the game or heard it all, you definitely hear the acting wasn't that good. The animation is, you know, the same, decent, and nothing groundbreaking, nothing smooth, nothing like that. But animation and the way the game looks is, you know, it's always it's about if it has a good story. Because when it comes to Garden of Ban Ban, the way it looks, it's just reused material after reused material back and forth, back and forth. It's literally like every room is the same, just a different color scheme, make you think you are in a different room. But, you know, the game could look terrible, you can have bad voice acting, but the main part is the story and the gameplay, because it's a game. You want to have a good driving story, a good gameplay. It, it involves a brand new block puzzle that is pretty, you know, tricky, gives me some portal vibes, but, you know, it's probably the best thing out of the game, and, it, and that puzzle is not even good, but in my opinion, it's probably the best thing of the game. And, you know, the rest is just that. Within Garden of Band Band 3, they added a lot of filler. And if I, when I mean a lot of filler, I mean a lot of filler. I can show on some screens moment now is when you have to, like, dress out this whole entire robot. And before you actually go and do that, you have to walk through a corridor, opening up around five to six doors just for nothing to happen. No suspense, nothing, chase, nothing chasing you. You're just opening up a door, waiting around five to six seconds for each door just to waste like an entire minute or so walking through one corridor before you go in a boss fight what in the purpose of existence is that little i know that did not sound like english but you know why was that a thing is his filler once you're done with the whole top boss fight what is it repetitive actions over and over again yes boss fights are kind of like that but all you have to do is just hit a button dodge moves and put tnt on a turtle uh, a what is this a gecko i don't know what that thing was and then explode it just to get two pieces of like a little party hat to put on a robot to make it work i'm telling you frailer is a big problem in this game and to make the robot drive unlike the drone that just goes you have to click it and click e on it and it only moves like what for three two seconds and then stops by saying one phrase from ban ban and need to do that taking another minute gets together across the hall just to get a bird out of the way so you can jump on it yeah filler is annoying there's lots of different parkour section grabbing buckets going back and forth for pointless thing just to get a key card to open up a next door they just filled a lot of that in and that's why i played for around two hours and 50 minutes and with some help on youtube and you know looking things up but if it wasn't for that i would have been playing for at least four hours not because it's a long game if you know what you're doing it could take you less than an hour to beat the game but if you do not know what you're doing they do not put any help they do not put any signs all repetitive action after repetitive action to get to a different door another corridor and a door that looks literally the exact same just to go and progress to a simple story of just what you still looking for your kid and other monsters are like yo this guy's tricking you and the other guy's like no don't, don't believe him he, he's tricking you then boss fight at the end happens and then you leave yeah the game story is just so simple as as of you looking for a simple kid that went missing your child but then you get thrown into this crazy business thing where they're using some green liquids to be make the you know employees or kids into like these monsters or something like that and then they're, they're using them as teachers to help out the daycare that 
remember this is a daycare and then you're just going deeper and now you're curious into what's happening here and how to get your child back yeah they could have easily this game could have been a lot shorter but in my opinion god of the band band 3 is not really good band band 1 was obviously for free it was a totally different story god of the band band 2 was for five dollars and definitely in my opinion was not worth it but it was like seeing a lot more content it was just like okay maybe in band band 3 want to see a good pause in it but nope Literally two, not even two months later, like a month and a half later, we get the third game that's just full of filler and literally just the exact same things as the other games. But that's really it for this video. I did this whole entire video is just Bam Bam 3, you know, has a huge problem and another huge problem. And I definitely do think the developers are not really going to learn from this. They keep on adding in new characters just to have new scenes in the games to make it, you know, seem like there's so much new content and at this point it's literally just a joke i don't think you should take anything serious if we see more trails and anything like that for Bam Bam 3 and this is really bad i mean four because they're making a fourth one if you don't know i probably might skip on it for the first time you know i played all three games did not like all three games the first one was definitely funny for the memes and all that stuff but at the end of the day you know Bam Bam is just the whole entire storyline is just going down and it's just dragging out way too long as it's supposed to be but that's it for the video tell me comments below what do you guys think some of you guys are probably think it's an amazing game and all that stuff but you know we all have opinions out there it's all opinions but one fact that we know is that there was so much filler in the game just so they'll be able to push that limit so you're confused not telling you any instructions so you cannot get a refund on the game because with that last week they said before chapter two or the second game came out you know they do not want to get refunds they want to make that bank but anywho tell me comments below like i said what do you guys do think and i'll see you guys all in the next video goodbye i do have another video planned for garden of band band let's talk about how they use AI, so you definitely want to stay tuned for that one because it's an interesting case.